Okay, we got a little closet. <gasps> Hello, kings, queens, and in between. It's Carmen here, and welcome back to another horror game. I am so excited because the new Fierce to Fathom episode is finally out. This is Fierce to Fathom Woodbury Getaway. I play a lot of scary games. Some of these have actually freaked me the f out and by some of them I mean pretty much all of them so I've been really excited for this new episode to come out but now that we're here I'm actually a little nervous <laughs> It's fine, we'll be fine. For those of you who don't know, these are like based on true stories. I say this because they're true stories and I don't really like want them to be true because they're horrifying. I'm super excited. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already without further ado. Let's get back into Fears to Fathom. It has been a hot goddamn second. Is it clear the schedules? It's only supposed to take two hours. It's only supposed to... <laughs> Well, calling off work tomorrow. <laughs> it should not be that bad. Please. Oh. Speaking of work, needed a coffee to get done with the day. Okay. Okay, part of me is like, oh my god, I miss these games. And then the other part of me is like, hmm, we don't want to be here right now. This is not... This little, this is not it. Boom! Potato chips! Okay, I need a coffee. Mission coffee. I need to prepare it. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. 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 Hydrate redemption chat. Except it's caffeine. Still, still, it's... Still technically hydrating because, um, even though. Did I get a cup or what? Because even though it's a diuretic, uh, you're still consuming more water than that. Except, <laughs> fuck those chips. Yay! That made like a very aesthetic. Oh my gosh. Where are the lids? Come here. Made a very aesthetic, like, throwing sound. Ah. <sighs> Need to use the restroom. See, this is what I said about this being a diuretic. Damn, we're already dead. Can I? Oh, are we chugging this before the restroom? Why did I think that was the restroom? Oh, here we go. We took two sips of coffee. Got a shit. All right, y'all know what time it is. Also, I don't know. Is my character? Uh, what what bathroom are we comfortable going in? I couldn't do it with the door wide open. Okay, damn. Then close the door? I have never played a game that they made you shut your stall door. <laughs> but, what do you mean? Oh my god. I was I thought that was a voice like detector meter. I was like Excuse me? This is the women's bathroom, no? No wonder I... <laughs> Why did I bring my coffee in? No wonder, bro. I swear to God, if someone's out here, I'm gonna throw this hot coffee in there. <gasps> I just threw up a little bit. <laughs> Yo, I told you I was gonna fight someone today. Why are my fists up? I was low-key ready. That is such a punchable face. I'm so mad and I feel so violated. I was literally just peeing and drinking my coffee while I peed. Is it like, come on, give me two seconds to live my life. Look at his, look at his nasty, nasty ass. I'm so sorry, ma'am. I didn't know you were in here. Okay, I was peeing pretty damn loud. So... How are you? Well, it's not okay, so I guess we'll ask how he is. You know what? Am I a bitch? I might be a bitch. Let's just let him do his job. He's, he's being so nice. I am actually just really bitter because he jump scared me so badly. I like to clean late because it's pretty quiet at this hour. No, my... I got... 
has that's a hazard. <laughs> They're going off, bro. This guy's creeping me the fuck out. You working late again, huh? Maybe he's supposed to be nice. Yeah, well. You young folks sure do put in the hours. Make sure to take care of yourself. You too. Mm -hmm. Serial killer vibes. Am chat, am I a bitch? Or is he giving us like bad vibes? It's not just me, right? Um, hello? Like I guess he's just trying to do his job. Clean this up. No, I'm kidding. That would be so mean. It that was right into a trash can, I saw it. This game just started and I already actually pooped my pants. I was, good thing we were on a toilet. Good thing we emptied right before then because holy shit. I, oh crap, I think that's my desk. Dang, how late is it? Why am I still here? Go for Sydney Harper. Okay, that's my name. Hello? Hey, Harp, it's Mike. Hey, it's Mike, guys. It's Mike. FTP stream, thank you so much for the tier one. Three months, baby. Hey, Mike. I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? Oh, guys, this is going to be great for the plot. Yeah, my battery dies at the worst oh, times. Yeah, I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh. I definitely was. I was ignoring him. Should I just... <laughs> <laughs> Should I just <laughs> No, this is Patrick. <laughs> Jay, thank you for 666 bits. Should I actually just let the awkward laugh like I'm going to yeah. We added 67 bits to Jayco's cheer. <laughs> thank you, Twitch. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um <laughs> This is so painful. Uh, anyway, uh what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. Just more overtime. Damn, Harp, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Ew, guys. Help. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. And Nora. Who the fuck is Nora? No. I cannot tell from, like, our character's vibe if she's just, like, so, so uninterested and he's not getting, he's not getting the clue at all or if she's actually busy. I can't really tell. I feel like she might hate him. You seem a bit annoyed about me calling. <laughs> Seriously, Harper, this is a bad time. Mike, come on, I'll do That's it now. Sydney Harper, I know. I'm sorry if I was being pushy. He is annoying. Just do it yourself, bro. Just kidding. I'm just struggling no worries, lately. Harper. I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. Why doesn't he book it? Hey. I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. You know, save on <laughs> gas and relive the good old it's days. It's the dot, so dot, dot. Sydney time before Nora gets there. My only options are sure and sounds good. Where's the pass button? This guy is giving me such right. weird vibes. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. Maybe he's nice. I might be the worst. When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Where? Oh, no. Nora and I were talking, and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. <laughs> I should have asked more. Sure, I'll keep it affordable. Nah! Ding! Why don't they look? Why am I the one booking it? Oh, this will be interesting. This will be interesting. Okay. Um... What the fuck is any of this? Um, hotel, rental. Rentac? Hello?
Oh, that's crazy. It's like typing up for me. That was so weird. Rentacabin.com. Oh boy. Woodbury. Why are we going here? 350 a night. Damn. That's a cute place. It's look like look, look it looks like a little Minecraft home. This is way out of our budget though. We're doing like a hundred or less. It's got good reviews. It has Wi-Fi, TV, AC. <gasps> this is cute. Oh shit. Two stars is kind of crazy. That doesn't look bad. It's got security cameras. That's also out of our budget. Cozy. Lo look out. Oh, okay. This one's five stars. Still out of our budget. Wait, this is under, this is under budget. This place looks pretty big. We got fishing, TV, Wi-Fi. Three stars. That's not horrible. Yeah, everything else is out of our budget. All right, well, I'm, you know, after thinking hard about all of our options, we got, oh, three guests, perfect. There's gonna be three of us, me, the guy who was just annoying me, and Nora. Axe Murder House confirmed. Hey, this has better reviews than some of the other houses that were more expensive, so. Hey, I'm assuming you get hundreds, if not thousands, of stories sent daily. <gasps> this is from the person who sent in the story. So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. I'm sorry if some of it is written weird, but I was rushed. Are we going to get, like, a little bit of a heads up? Okay. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth. When I was in my early 20s, I worked on a big, at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which I didn't, which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. So we're overworked. We need a break. The job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. Just a city girl. <laughs> uh, 100 a night for three people. Three bed and two bath. I know, right? Even though it's a big place, too. Even the ones that were like 300 a night, I was like, yeah. It's, it's still not a bad deal. Especially compared to now. It's crazy. I did not read that. Wait, did I read it all? I'm Sydney Harper, and this story takes place during one of those days. Yeah, I didn't read it all. My bad. You guys probably did. I was up there for like 25 minutes. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend getaway to rural Vermont, which sounded like a perfect break from the work cycle of work. And my other friend, Nora, was quick to jump on board as well. Okay, so Mike is a college friend. And Nora is another friend. There's no, like... Like, Mike seems a little annoying, but I think he's a friend. The plan was simple. We rent a small cabin, close our shift early on Friday, leave, and be back on Monday. Mike came to pick me up. Yeah, he's trying to, like, rekindle something on the vacation, we're thinking... Two days later. Okay. Here we go. Time to enjoy the... Huh? I beg your finest pardon? Bro is just cheesing. Why does he look like a bobblehead? Oh, shit. Um. Why did I hang up on him? Oh, pulling into the garage now. You downstairs yet? I forgot my suitcase! In the elevator at first. Oh my god, that was an immediate L. Is that Mike? <gasps> no, that was that friendly guy who was there before. Hey, Mike! Oh my gosh. <laughs> 
Hug. Where my hug at? <laughs> he looks like he'd say that for real. That's still how you hug people? I beg your finest pardon? What is wrong with my hug? What did I do? <laughs> Toby, thank you for 999 pets. <laughs> We added 100 bits and 100 bonus bits to chaos underscore Xfu's cheer. Thanks, Twitch. Tofu, thank boo boo. Thank you, thank you. Ew! Why don't you hug me like you miss me? What if I also. Just a test hug to see if you smell first? I cannot believe he said that. This guy is giving me the biggest ick, and we don't even know him. Fair enough, but for the record, I showered just for the occasion. Nothing is too good for Sydney Harper. I am not giving this man a long hug. You can just throw your stuff in the back and we'll get on our way. What is this? Okay, you know what? You can throw myself in the back too. Damn, Mr. Where My Hug At is crazy. All right then, Harp, are you ready to hit the road? I'm ready to hit something. <laughs> Let's do this. Where is Nora? She'll meet us there. The route through the city would have been a detour for her anyways. All right then, Harp. Why does he not have a suitcase? Just a cooler. What are there, body parts in there? Creepo. Why doesn't he have a suitcase? Guys. Stab him first. I do not feel safe. See, this is so misleading because it's probably like he is just putting me off so hard. But he's probably not even going to be the actual problem. He's just a problem in my brain right now. This is crazy. It was starting to snow. Oh, that's kind of cozy. And see, thank you for the little, what do you even, the po power up? Excuse me? Isn't it weird? We used to dream about escaping our college and now here we are. He is trying so hard to rekindle something right now. Trying to escape from the life we wanted to live. Funny how that works. Change is just too hard, like trying to adjust to the new job. Speaking of jobs, how's your new job going? We're working on this project that uses machine learning to predict market trends. It's pretty cutting edge stuff. Sounds like you're shaping the future. Not quite Tony Stark yet, but I'll take it. You know, I never understood. What do consultants even do? <laughs> we consult. Oh, who said don't make him mad? He, he might kill you. You're actually right. I need to be nicer to him. Low key. That sounds like important work. Nope, it's just our rental. Harp, do you ever miss, miss college? I'm trying to read my text. Hello? What the fuck was that? Did you see that school bus? There was a school bus. Maybe it's a project. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home. What the fuck? Ew, I didn't like that. It made me like look out the window like that. Okay. Oh yeah, we're not there yet. They said they're looking for travel confirmation. Oh, a deer, buddy. Eee. Oh, snap. That was close. You know, I read on the internet that in Native American lore, seeing a deer cross your path like that is getting a message from the universe. Well, what was our message? Was my message to maybe not get in a car with you, buddy? Cause that's 
kind of the vibe that I'm getting. Like, I feel like I need to be armed. Okay, this is fine. I should be, like, enjoying this. Oh, my gosh. Are we even close? Please ensure your lines of slice and describe. Oh, got it, got it. Um, it should be about an hour and a half from here. Okay. Driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through an intergalactic space. What is bro yapping about? <laughs> he said, <laughs> this feels like every cult serial killer story ever. Hour and a half with this dude's awkward. That is the horror game here. That's the entire game. Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It's like stars and galaxies rushing past us. Bro has never seen snow before. It's kind of beautiful. No, where my hug at? <laughs> Shut up, bro. Like he keeps like, like side eyeing me while we drive. He's a mega techie nerd with zero social skills. <laughs> Maybe the other girl's the killer. Why are you guys assuming that there's a killer? Sometimes it's just like a little quirky, weird stuff happening and not a killer. Wait for the program to respond. Oh no. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Gonna feel so bad when Mike dies. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Okay, now this is getting freaky. He'll be fine, he'll be fine. Yo, harp. I don't like that he calls me that. Check this out. Pizza. Oh, are we stopping? Oh, we getting some food, I'm down. Guys, I want a pizza right now so badly. You know harp. Why does he use my name so much? I gotta tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. This pizzeria is exactly where it appeared on my GPS. That's crazy! Guys, what? Oh my gosh, the pizzeria is exactly where the GPS said it was, as is the navigation system's literal job. That's so crazy. It's like living in the future. <laughs> this is definitely 2001. <laughs> I'm so hungry. I think I could eat myself a whole pizza myself. Honestly, saying let's run it. I could fuck up a pizza right now. Most special. That's what I'm gonna get. Most special, mo pizza. Why can't I open the door? Wow, I have to wait for him. Hello? Come on in. What is going on? Thank you. I'm glad he permitted my entrance. <laughs> Timo Tan, thank you so much for the tier one sub. Welcome to stream. The door said pull. Oh, did he push it? Yo, he's cursed. Yo, margarita pizza. I would fuck that up right now. I like... Ooh, uh, uh. This is my pizza music. Look at everyone here feasting on their pizzas. <gasps> he was crazy. I clicked, I clicked on him. I don't know why that scared me so badly. How are you doing, my friend? I'm pretty hungry. Are you here for the pizza? Just looking for a little help. Good luck. I'm not gonna help you, bro. I'm nosy as fuck though, what does he want? No, I don't wanna help him. <laughs> Can you, stop! Are you gonna order? Ah! Bro, why is everyone up in my business? 
Am I supposed to talk to you too? Oh, he does not want to talk to me. How's the pizza? That guy's horrifying. I think Hose might have ruined other pizzas for us. Is this place called Hose? It's our first time in the area. That's amazing. Where are you headed? We're on our way to a conference in the next town over with my buddy here. We just stop to eat whenever a place looks interesting. This place definitely has a cozy vibe. That's one way to put it. Best decision of the trip so far. Oh wow, so they're into this. Just passing through. I'm not ha I'm gonna, not gonna say where we're renting. Interesting. Better get back to this pizza. Oh yeah, enjoy the pizza. This guy wants me to offer help so badly it's hurting him. Where are you headed? Who are you? I'm Sydney. Look, Sydney. We're just here to enjoy our pizza in, in peace. Thanks for understanding. You know what? That I can't even be mad at her for saying that because I am just like walking around being like, how's your pizza? Like, they're clearly just trying to enjoy their food by themselves. I hope you enjoy your meal. Also, what the fuck are you watching? Do you have any recommendations? Get the cheese. Just the cheese. Bro does not want to do any extra work. That's so funny. Okay, I'm sorry. That other music was driving me insane. Here we go. Okay. You find folks who know what you want to eat? We'll get three slices of each. I'll go with pepperoni, cheese, and a veggie. And for me, bro said cheese. Just cheese. Just cheese. Actually, oh, margarita sounds so good. I'm so hungry. Oh my gosh. I'm actually so hungry. <laughs> All right, then six hot slices coming right up. That'll be twenty-two fifty. <laughs> Thanks, lad. Why does he look like Wreck-It Ralph? Bro is built like Wreck-It Ralph. He's the most like friendly-looking person here. All right. This guy is just like ah. Wish someone could help me. Oh. Ew, I can just hear the people munching behind us. Y'all hear that? Long sniff. It smells so good in here. Okay. <laughs> Guys, this is so awkward. <laughs> Make it stop. No, actually. I'm so sorry, guys. Oh, no. What happened? Oh, you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. Is that Lily? But something last minute popped up. I'm not going to bore you with all of the details. The long and short of it is... That sounds like Lily Pichu. Because one of my clients needs a last minute change. Wait. Am I tripping? Their payments are about the only thing keeping the lights on. I hate to leave so late, but I've got to keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it and be on my way. That's got to be her, right? Am I lying? Am, am I, I might just be tripping. I'm just, it's just wishful thinking. Okay. Um, all right. Well, great. She's going to be late. So I'm stuck with this weirdo. Yeah, I just saw. That's a bummer. I guess we'll have to start the fun without her. Can you not? Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. Can we not? Yo, I'm about to... I just lost my appetite. I don't even need my order. What do you mean? Guys, this is the worst. Thank you. This is the worst. And now my other friend isn't showing up. I'm stuck with this guy. 
I didn't love that. Oh, damn. This pizza slaps, bro. <laughs> I can't believe Nora's missing out on this bomb-ass pizza. I really can't. I really can't. Oh my gosh. Oh, the sounds! Why does it sound like that? Okay, let me see. I'm chewing. I'm chewing. You actually eat the crust? It's kind of wasteful not to, don't you think? I'd eat a tire if I was hungry enough. <laughs> eat someone else's tires. You still got some drive. <gasps> no, fuck me. Not this guy again. I know he's gonna ask for our help. He just was wandering around. He's like, ah, oh, I just wish someone could help me. Hello there. I saw y'all pull in that, driving that nice old truck. Are you watching who pulls in and taking notes? Not at all, my friend. Just because you keep saying my friend to someone does not make you friends. I just noticed you seem to be heading the same direction I was. Y'all mind if I hitch a ride with you? How would he know we're headed in the same direction? Even if we came from a certain way, what if we were going back that way? I agree. Anyone that says my friend clearly has ulterior motives. Ulterior motives. Okay, let's see. Where's your car? Who needs a car when there are fine friends like you to pass the time? Y'all wouldn't even know I was there. Quiet as a church mouse and twice as nice. So what do y'all say? Care to give this free spirit a ride down the snowy road? I am not sure. What is, why is he asking me? I'm not even driving the car. Can we just say no? Is that so mean? I want my friend to say no. Maybe it's not that bad. I'm not sure. Surely you can find just a little bit of room for me. Well, we don't have another seat. There isn't any space. You gotta be shitting me, lady. No space. I know there's a middle seat. You scared of me or something? Sorry, except I'm not. You ain't too kind, are you? Unkind people meet them meet unkindness themselves. You best be careful out there. Was that a threat? <laughs> I was like, why doesn't he say anything? Okay. No, no, y'all got me all wrong. Sorry, I'm just cold and tired is all. Yeah, thanks. That was definitely a threat. Well, that was weird. <laughs> Silly. Guys. He didn't even order anything. I do feel bad. I shouldn't, but I do. After all these years, you're still that same old harp. What does that mean? Let me back to open chewing, open mouth chewing my pizza. Oh my gosh, okay. Where's he going? I don't know. Imagine he just crawls in the back of the car. <laughs> he literally was like, you're not kind and unkind people get met with unkind fates. Oh, I need a burp. All right. Uh. <laughs> um, uh. excuse me. That's amazing. Oh, Nora texted us again. What'd she say? Holy, that was good. It was very good. Are we close? Oh my god, that guy scared me so badly. Give me the keys. I'm going to drive so you can get a break. 
take a break while I drive, Michael. <laughs> I'm afraid of what kind of break you're going to give me. What? Give me the key so we can go. There's one condition. I get first choice of bedrooms when or if we get there. Ooh. Bro, what is he saying? Stop, I'm scared. Bye, have a nice night. Wait, I'm scared. Everyone is so suspicious and- <gasps> Oh! <clears throat> this is fine, we're good. We're good. Now I take the wheel, and this is a true horror game. Let's see what we got. <laughs> Red Sea, thank you so much for 666 bits. Thank you, I'm doing a poop for a blink redemption. Where my cuddle at? I'm gonna lose my mind if he like keeps trying to pull some shit. Evening, Vermont. This is your host on WKWB. Hell yeah, your baby! Watch my driving skills. I'm about to crush this shit. We're gonna get there in 20 minutes max. The GPS says an hour. You're lying. There's go. Oh, there's another car. That's my ass. Okay. Thought this was. Uh... <gasps> oh, stop! You made me crash. You made me crash the car. I'm trying not to. Also, what, where's the GPS at? Where am I going? Oh my god. I didn't know that there would be oncoming traffic. I just got honk dead. That's cr <laughs> Damn! You get your license from a cereal box. Listen, bro. Don't harp me. That car drove me right off the edge. I crashed Mike's truck. No, I didn't. Check out my music. This thing has four wheel drive. We can off road it. We can off road. Ooh, the speed limit's 25. I'm hitting way harder than that. It's probably fine. As long as someone's like in the road. Guys, I'm gonna be motion sickness. We missed the turn. No one fucking told me! We're probably fine. Okay, okay, damn, you know what? Shut up, Michael! I should've just let Mike drive. No, I am crushing this. His, he has a shitty car. I should've been able to make that turn. Okay. See, we're good to go. He finally said something that makes <laughs> Shut up! I am not bad at this. This, it's just messed up. Step into my Dude, that was literally a glitch. Stop. This bridge, it's fine. Really Damn, another car is crazy. Do you need to not town. run into me because no I'm doing this side of the road? I could spend a year alone and never miss a soul. I could try my hardest and I'll never reach my Dude, we got some relaxing music and shit. Yo, Mike is a horrible passenger princess because he did not tell me my turn was coming up. Where my turn at? Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know what? Even though looking at this, I'm like, yeah, this is a cursed place to visit. Like, that you're just getting a random place in a random cabin in the woods somewhere. Part of me with the snow and stuff, I'm like, wait, this is kind of a vibe, guys. 10 out of 10 driving. Thank you. Thank you. Wait, you crashed one time and shackled by lust. So true. Oh, shit. You think the police noticed? Woodbury. Okay, we're here. And I haven't been arrested for my driving, so... <laughs> Pull her over. No! I'm doing great. I drove past our cabin. Mike! Tell me where the fuck to go. What cabin is ours? Is this it? Are we here? I think the address was 241. Is this it? 241. Oh yeah, here we are. 
Oh, do you want me to like drive your car there? Or should we just go in? The keys in the lock box. Oh, I couldn't have parked. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, at least there's a police car driving around. Watch them be like, hey, we're looking for a suspicious person that escaped. Or that, like, was reported. Okay, I'm parked, like, here. Nice and easy. How did he get in the car with me? And this should be it. Shh, we don't need to pay attention to the bottom part. I thought you were just gonna keep driving there. Who said he's a ghost? What, I already killed him or something? Whoa, god damn. Bro brought a cooler and that's it. That's kind of crazy. Okay, where's the lockbox? That's the mailbox. Oh, okay. Move, bro. Move, bro. Hold the left mouse button to slide. Oh. Um. Five. One. Oops. Seven, six. Alright, now I'm just wondering when... Hello? Oh. Now I'm just wondering when Nora's gonna get here, cause now I'm gonna have to put up with this motherfucker. I guess... I'm like, it could be worse, I could be alone. Maybe I would rather- Oh god, I would rather. What a great place. It smells so nice in here. Okay, that's a huge green flag. When that shit smells good. That's what she said? I really need to hit the John. Take your time, Mike. While I'm at it, can you put these groceries away? Sure. The house was cozy and well furnished. Okay, take that luggage. Let's put the groceries away. Where, where did he put the fucking? Oh, here they are. Ugh, I don't like that the windows are all open. First thing I want to do is how to open the cooler first. Okay, damn. <laughs> okay. Please. We got eggs. We got ice cream. Please, I was trying to put it in the door. It did not like that. And lettuce. Okay, that's an interesting food combo. We got so much milk for two people. Oh, you know what? They got cornflakes. We're covered. Oh my god, this guy scares the fuck out of me. Pre-scrambling the eggs. <laughs> it's very, um... It's very spooky, I would say. Long drive and all that pizza really did a number on me. Well, all the groceries are put away. Hang on, I really need to pee. Thanks. We're just, like, dividing and conquering up in here, I guess? Okay. The smell alone. Ew, told me the pizza had really done a number on Mike. Don't tell me that. Do not tell me that. Stop. I don't like that it pees like this. Hi, we've checked in. Because this makes me feel like I have to like get up and do something, but I have to wait to pee? Like, that literally scares me. What do you mean, see to crouch? Fuck me. I do not miss these games. Why did I say that I did? Can I walk? Oh, I have to wash my hands. <laughs> They're picky in this game. They make you wash your hands? And then what, brush your teeth? 
Yeah, imagine the janitor shows up again. I'd cry. Can I leave? Am I planning on showering? Like, what do you mean? I didn't have to pee. Okay, well, I washed my hands 45 times. Guys, it's not letting me... Oh my god, I was so crouched. Where'd Mike go? Probably upstairs, right? <gasps> Damn! Okay. You feeling better after the drive? I'm good. Want to check out the house? Sounds good to me. Let's see what this place has to offer. After you. As long as there's not someone else up in here. Okay, we got a little... Closet. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> Why is there someone in the house that we rented? I can't. I thought I was safe. That actually made me sick. Holy shit. At least I stayed calm though. At least I didn't overreact. At least you didn't scare me that bad. Oh hey, you're here. Where my hug at? Shut up! You scared us, you dumb bitch. Oopsie daisy. He said oopsie daisy. I'm like sweating. I might have pissed my pants. Like, lost a few years of my life for sure. Should have read the Airbnb policy. <laughs> Why is he up in my face like this? Like, bro's up my ass right now. Can't confirm, and I'm not enjoying it. Thank you, Grotex, for the blank redemption. Carmen, how's it going? Hi, welcome to stream, love. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, this has got to be the host. Do not laugh. This is horrible. He didn't mean to. What? Welcome to my home sweet home. What a lovely couple. Ew! Ew! Ugh! We're, oh, we're not a couple. Ugh! Never! Oh my God. Oh my God. We are not. Never. In a million years. We didn't expect anyone to be here. Oh, um. I was out looking for my cat earlier, and I remembered the TV has been on the fritz here. I just thought I'd stop by and try to get it working again, since the last few folks left a bad word for it. You know, they say treat your guests like family. My family doesn't go without TV. He thought I was dating that. Is that so mean? Here's the problem, though. His personality is even worse. So, there's like no redemption here. He looks like a, like, come on. <laughs> Insomnia, and Encart, thank you so much for the tier one sub. He has nothing to say about this? Why are you so close to me? Now that you folks are here, let me show you around my sweet home. Right now? I'd be a bad owner if I didn't give you the grand tour. Or you just leave and not interact with us like every other normal host. At least, oh, he had nervous energy. He had nervous energy. At least I'm not gonna be the one fucking opening the doors anymore. Here's your shower. That thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in the Amazon jungle. Okay, see from far away, I don't feel as horrified by him. But like, that was horrible. That was horrible. He deaf heard me crash into the house. I totally did crash into the house. I crashed the car into the house. How was he gonna say, oh, I didn't know you guys would be here. We were not quiet. I also peed really loudly. And my bro here. I was gonna say took the fattest dump. Oh man. Welcome in and watch her panic at scary noises. I was not pa I was I was I that was I would say a very calm 
Cool collected reaction. <laughs> Ritsu, thank you so much for 999 bits. Thank you, love. Okay, okay. The Amazon oh, jungle cool, shower. Man. We love that. Malik, thank you so much for the tier one sub. Okay. This, this sink doesn't work, unfortunately. Not to worry, I'll get it fixed for you real soon. You don't have to. Like, honestly, I would rather not work. I don't want to have to worry about him just showing up in the house. Let me show you the other bedroom now. Oh, God, okay. Okay. Look, Harp, this room has a oh, nice a ass man. view. Any room with a mirror in it would have a nice ass view, bro. Mm. But you know, he's probably gonna claim this one because he said he wanted to claim his room and stuff, right? All right, anyways, you think that's nice, mister? Wait till I show you the deck. Follow me now, please. Okay, let's see. What was that? You see that look? What was that? Is this the deck? Oh. This is, why would we want to be out here on the deck? It's freezing cold. Please tell me bro does not live in that shed. This is incredible, incredibly cold. <laughs> this is one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. It's a great spot for fishing too. Oh yeah, that was on the website. This like screenshot right here looks so scary. Look, is this foreshadowing? Bro is just creeping behind Mike there. Who said that's a girthy deck? Why do you have to say it like that? Why do you have to say it like that? You're gonna open, go to bed and see that. See, that's what's horrible about Fierce Fathom games is like, I feel like the fear from these carry over. Like Outlast Trials, that doesn't carry over for me. Other like, like a nun chasing us around, I'm like, whatever. These creep me out after stream though. Where my hug at? Ah! I, I deserve that. I was so up in his face. I was trying to be funny, guys. I, that karma is a bitch. Why are you looking at me like that? Why are you looking at me like that? Here's a storage room. Oh, yeah, I already saw that. If you need anything, tools, extra blankets, and whatnot. Okay, knives are in there. If the power ever goes out, you can use this flashlight here. No! That's the same energy as, you know, you're just walking by and it's like, yeah, press X to hide. Girl, why would I ever, like, why would you tell me that if it isn't something I'm gonna need? I don't wanna ever have to need that. We might not need it. Trust me, it's always best to know where your light is. That is good, that is facts though. But, oh my god. <laughs> okay. Chill, bro. Chill. Chill. I love that he walks by and just like looks at the art. Oh shit, where'd they go? I can't let them out of my sight because these motherfuckers keep jump scaring me. Alrighty, folks, I see you already stocked the fridge with some tasty food. It's just milk, by the way. Just milk. You see the knob? Turn the knob up for cool it, for more cooling and down to cool it off. Okay. I tend to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you, folks, the water heater. Oh, boy. Can that, like, already be on, please? You know what? I actually played Amnesia the Dark Descent like so recently for the first time on stream. It was like two months ago. I swear. Okay, maybe Dark Descent wasn't two months ago, but the second one I played relatively recently. My gameplay is on YouTube if you want to check it out. Um, what? Nothing to worry about down here. Just the old water heater and some old storage stuff. Why did he say um? If it ever stops working, just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire right back up and you'll be back in business. I'm going to cry if I ever have to go down here. 
Are you coming, miss? <gasps> he doesn't want me to look around down here. Something's down here, guys. Someone is living down here. I swear to God. Am I being paranoid? No, look at them! Hey, sir, what's the deal with that room over there? Nothing you need to need to concern. Con pause, I just had a stroke. Pause. Nothing you two need to concern yourself with. You, 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 you. That is our concern. I'm staying in a house. I know some guy. I'm going to cry. I know someone's staying in this house with us. I kind of use this basement as storage. Renters don't really need the space. They really ought to keep upstairs. Okay, well, I was just curious. Let's move on. No access to guests. I couldn't open the door. Guys, I swear to actual... Can we go? Why are y'all waiting for me? Oh my god, is he mad that I tried to open the door? Did I mention, well, no, maybe I ought to keep it to myself. Mention what? You can't say shit like that. The fella I bought this house from, well, told me his mother died down here. Exit the game. Exit. Exit. Where, where's the escape? The escape button isn't escaping, guys. Chat? Chat? Yeah, maybe don't. Don't tell your guests that. Guys, I swear to God, the mama is in that room. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night. Are you shitting in my dick? Some said they could hear something shuffling around down here. I'm done. I'm logging off. Not to scare you folks, but if I were you, I wouldn't really step down here. Not to scare us, though. Why are you so close to me, bro? <laughs> he said, <laughs> Oh no, I beg your pardon. It's, <laughs> The looks on your faces. <laughs> I'm only joking. Why would you say that? Like, bro, zero stars. At this point, my creep meter was quietly pinging at around 6 out of 10. Yo, my creep meter was at 10 out of 10 the second I set foot in that motherfucker's room. And he jump scared up my butt. Alrighty, folks. Snow starting to pick up. I'm going to hit the road now. Got to find that damn cat. Okay, bye, buddy. Bye, buddy. By the way... What was the name of the booking? I must be getting old. Oh, on the booking. It's Sydney. Ha, Sydney, that's right. A pretty name for a pretty girl. I am pretty. F creeped the fuck out by you. He definitely is. Is it just me or is that dude super weird? It's not just you. But I feel like that Loki might have been a strategy of like trying to make us feel really uncomfortable about going downstairs because he has someone living in there i swear to god he just doesn't want to have to pay for another person or something i swear mike is sniffing your hair <laughs> Ew! brother ugh. let's see if there's anything good on tv actually i'm going to take a quick shower i want to you know shower like the amazons or whatever it said i'll find something to watch while you're in there chuckle let me know if it don't say chuckle like that <laughs> don't do that let me know if it feels like you're under a waterfall what a weird guy thanks see you in a bit that jump scare in this room right there made me actually sick can we turn that off thank you is there a radio on Oh, bro's like watching TV or something. Okay, never mind. Okay, waterfall, baby. The shower door was... Oh. I appreciate the concern. 
Does that mean there's gonna be a cutscene though? Please don't give me music like that. I feel very vulnerable right now. <laughs> Yeah, I know I had to cl clear the rooms, make sure no one's fucking in them. I have clothes on now, right? I didn't need to use the towels. Okay, well, what do I need to use? A toothbrush? Am I done? Please, I swear to God. Guys, I actually, like, I... I don't want to get jump scared anymore. I feel like walking anywhere in this house is just bad. Like, the next thing you know, Nora's gonna show up. It's, oh, God! Check this out. I found a fishing rod in the shed. Planning to catch dinner? We actually should, because bro only brought milk and spinach. Okay. Yeah, I am going back to being a Genshin Impact streamer, because I this is a lot for me right now. This is a lot. <sighs> okay. I don't know. It's cold out there. I guess it could be fun. Okay, well. I guess we're going to go fishing. I'm really good at fish fishing. I'm really good at fishing, by the way, guys. Um, It has... Everything to do with patience, and that is pretty much my strong suit, so just imagine all the fish I catch. Do you want to just grab the other fishing rod? Yeah, just give me a second. Where is it? Oh. Okay. Where's the, am I, am I, hello, guys? What am I missing here? Oh, it's there on the wall. That's crazy. Oh, snap, I saw killer. Recipe for baked carp. All I saw was killer, and I was like, oh, were you gonna tell me that before I walked outside by myself? We'll need to catch three carp, though. <laughs> Not the blind email. <laughs> Listen, I wasn't looking down. I'm too tall for that. Okay, we need bait. Whenever you are ready, grab a carp bait. Let's go to the creek. We're going to catch some carp harp. Please don't make rhymes with my name. Okay, bait. Oh, wait, which one? What are we catching? Carp? Sweet corn is good for that. Okay, chill, bro. How do I drop this? I don't want that bait. I want this one. Put on hook. Oh. There we go. Corn. Corn. Oi. Okay. Let's go fishing! At night. And look at this swing around. Look at that thing swing. Swing that thing. That sounds a little sus. This is actually really cool. This would be beautiful in the summer. I hope those carp are biting today. Well, we will see. Thank you, Zeus. I appreciate that. The pink hearts. <gasps> New and unlocked. Never seen before. Actually, have it on my stream. Should I be sitting in this chair? What do you mean I lost the bait? Are you shooting my pants? And I can't even sprint in this game. Why am I going so slow? At least I have a weapon. Like anyone shows up, they're getting whacked. No, not that one. Where'd I put the corn? Aha! I'm bringing this shit with me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Genius mine! That way if I get impatient and pull the hook again, I will have backup. Here. Yeah. Yeah. Can I sit? Thank you. Is 
It's actually kind of cool, not gonna lie. I love the water too. I thought the gerbling meant that I had a fish. I'm pretty sure I did. You know what? I'm telling you right now. Nora's gonna sneak up on us and jump scare us, and I'm gonna be pissed. But since I see it coming. I'm gonna be prepared, and we'll be absolutely fine. Wait, oh shit, fuck. I didn't know what the plot of the movie was. Oh my god, the fish! Get back here, you son of a bitch. Ooh! Acquired! Keep. They, they say, whenever there's one carp, there's always more. Who's they? I caught my dinner. You're on your own, buddy. Ugh. I'm gonna get. Can I? I'm trying to stand up. I'm trying to stand up. Yeah, I understand that, but I. <gasps> oh! I can't get up. The 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 bait is behind me. It's not letting me get up. Tofu, thank you so much for 999 bits. Guys, what do I do? I'm clicking escape. It's not letting me out. I'm right and left clicking and it's just doing this. Oh, my alarm's going off. This is crazy. Space bar, it's not letting me move. And then I'm trying to just like W-A-D-S this shit, but I can't move. E? Nope. C? My line is out. How do I reel that hoe in? I don't have any bait. Do I just wait? It's not letting me reel it in with the mouse at all. Fishing pole, reel it in. I'm not gonna catch anything without. It's not even letting me... I know I need to attach it. I literally broke this. Guys. What the fuck do I do? You scared the game so much you broke it. What did I actually do? Give it a quick reset. You might be able to start from here. Yeah, I think I had to like fully close the game. You also can't even like, I don't know if it'll save cause you can't even like go to a menu. I just have to shut down the game. <gasps> oh my God. Yes! Oh my god, I love you. Fierce Fathom, thank you. Even though that bugged for me a little bit. I love that. That's saved. I love that. Okay, we're going back. We're running it. Wait, why did that message get deleted? I didn't get to read it. Okay, now I grab my fishing rod. I'm gonna crouch, just give me this. Yeah, just give me a second. Okay, fishing rod. And then, oh. Okay, 
put on the hook. I'm gonna set this in front of me instead of behind, because I think that was the problem, is it just like, well, I recast the line without anything on it and then I couldn't draw it back. But maybe I can sit down with this in my hand. Oh my gosh, I can. That's amazing. All right, let's run it. It was too far. No, I got this. Boom! Would you and Lily react to an animation shot if I made one of all y'all's? Yes! Oh shit, God. oh shit. Oh fuck, fuck, fuck. We're here to fish. We fish it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Damn, why are they making this so fucking annoying? It, it like fully goes one way or the other. Ah! Come here, bitch. Like, I can't just hover. Like, if it's in the middle, I'm toast. This is actually, why is this so fucking annoying? I might lose my mind. When I catch you, bitch! When I catch this fucking fish, I'm eating it raw. Out of spite, I'm eating it alive. Oh my fucking god, come here, bitch. Come here! Oh my god! Tell you guys, I was good at fishing. Imagine I accidentally throw it back. Oh my god. Here we go. That was crazy! It, it makes it, it like full sense. Like if you hit any direction, it like yeets it to the side. So I can't like relax. We don't want bluegill, do we? Get the fuck out of here. That's crazy. Just gotta jiggle it. I tried! I tried! Oh shit. Fish! This one's a carp. I can feel it because it's being a little bitch right now. Jiggle. Jiggle. I'm a pro. Bitch! You know, I'll keep it. I know, but I'm taking it out, because if not, I'm just gonna catch it again. That was a warning to its friends. Okay, I'm gonna try to fish over this way. I'm feeling like this is a good spot. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Manifesting. Carp circle. Carp, carp, carp. Oh, Jesus. Oops. Jiggle, 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 jiggle. Whoa, this one's a speedster. Get back here. Bro. Carp, yes! Crushed it, one more. Damn, are you gonna help? Are you gonna maybe catch any? Bro's useless. That's crazy. I, I need you guys to kill, to kill me on, um, I'm sorry you're, I, I, you guys have to warn me if stream quality is bad because I'm streaming on, what do you mean I didn't catch anything? Because I'm streaming on YouTube as well right now. It looks like it just like crashed really low. So if it is, let me know and I'll maybe just do through Twitch. Wait, help. Goldfish! Better not run out of bait. Run out of bait. Um, I am sorry your message got deleted as I saw that. I don't know why it did. 
I didn't see anything that like warranted being I didn't see any spoilers or anything. I would say that that will get a message deleted if you have anything spoiling. But I I don't think it did. I don't know, I didn't really get a chance to read it. But opinions are welcomed. Always. And we also always respect other people's opinions too. Even if we don't all agree. Finally! I got my food, bitch! I got it! So I've been getting some random loads and data drops, but honestly, I thought it was me. Oh, okay, okay. Let me know. Sorry, I read it wrong. Do you still have access to the message? Ben, would you mind resetting it? All right, Harp, looks like we got three carp. Do you want to head back and throw these in the oven for dinner? Let's do it! Oh my god, I thought that was someone else just without a shirt on for a second there. Yeah, I know, we gotta, um... You gotta, like, sc scale it, skin it and stuff. Why is the music getting scary? It was so peaceful for a second. Guys, I really want... I really want to be back in the fishing game. That was such a good little, like, wait, should I not have this shit? Shut that. I'm cleaning the fish. Okay, he's cleaning it. Do you mind prepping the marinade? Sure. Just take a bowl, throw in ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper, salt, Italian seasoning, paprika, and yogurt. On it! I remembered. Salt and pepper. Why is this open? I need yogurt. Oh, the frozen yogurt. What am I putting it in like a bowl? Uh, we got salt and pepper here. Um, where are our other- hold your horses. Okay, damn, chill. I'm looking for the seasonings. What is this? Oh, garlic. Yeah, we love garlic in this house. Italian, I believe paprika. And then olive oil. Girl, where is our olive oil? Oh, it's probably up here. Ta-da! Marinade? Done. Look, I did. Do you mind throwing the fish in the marinade in the casserole? Yep. Boom. Oh, you have to add the fish first? Okay, well, let me just throw this on the ground. Fish. Fish. Fit. Only two fish? Oh, okay. Marinade. And then the veggies. Now, could you add the veggies? I read it needs to go for 30 minutes at 400. Okay. Where are you going? You're lost? I can't really set the oven, but... I'll put it in. <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, okay, okay, I got the message. Uh, hey, Carmen, I know you're a big fan of... Excuse me, Michael. I know you're a big fan of, I'm assuming, Ben, I'm assuming this is, um, Asin's message. While we wait for it to cook, have we played some board games? I saw some in the, in the room next to the living room. I guess we could. Just grab whatever catches your eye. Okay, Mr. Bossy, why doesn't he do it? In the living room? I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, look, a little cozy fireplace. <laughs> Sudoku. What is he talking about? Y'all see games in here? Am I tripping? Stop. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, here. <gasps> My hands are full. No, I want to do the Ouija board. Fuck that. What could go wrong? We gotta talk to the mommy that lives in the house. Mommy. 
Oh snap, is that a Ouija board? <laughs> Who said, did I see Monopoly? I changed my mind. I changed. Holly once told me she contacted her dead grandma through one of these boards. I can't stand her spiritual bullshit. Damn, he's gonna be the first to get haunted then. Hey, remember how the dude was acting weird about the basement? What if we tried this down there? Why didn't I pick Monopoly? Why did we do this? I, like, it gave me a choice. That's crazy. You know, maybe we would have played Monopoly in the basement anyway, and it would have been just as scary. Watch out for spiders down here. Man, I don't give a fuck about a spider. But well, someone's mammy comes down. Someone, someone's, whoa. Someone's mama attacks me. I'm going to be very scared. Hello? Let's turn off all these lights and see if this thing... Why would you do that? We're doing this and we're expecting our friend to come in later. She's going to scare the shit out of us. Why don't you turn off... Oh my gosh, she's always just telling me what to do. Piss me the fuck off. How do I turn off... Oh. I have to turn them off fucking individually, of course. I can't even turn this one off. We'll keep that one on. I can't even see where bro is. Where's that flashlight? I seriously cannot see. Oh, now I can and I don't like it. Um, anyways, do you know how this works? Nope. Here's how it works. First, we place our fingers lightly on the planchette. We have to ask questions and the spirits. If there are any, we'll move the planchette to spell out the answers. Or at least that's what... Molly told me. Did I say, is that Holly or Molly? Doesn't matter, she's not here. Unless she is. One more thing, Harp. Never take your fingers off until we say goodbye, otherwise it might tick off the spirits. Easy. You just gotta stay cool, calm, and collected. You go first. Are there any spirits who wanna talk to us? I thought we were supposed to do it together. Wait, I forgot to pay attention. Oh, yes? No way. Are you, are you moving it? How would that be? Oh, okay. I'm imagining my hand on the board. Okay, that wasn't me. Okay, I got one too. Go ahead. How's the afterlife treating you, buddy? Hey, be respectful. Oh, we're done. We're done for. It's gonna say fine. Oh. Are you, what's your name? This is too fast. S? Q? Space. <laughs> Bitch, what? What is this? My turn. Give us a sign. Let us know you're here. It's gonna be Nora and it's gonna scare the shit out of me. Psych! This is fine. I don't want a sign. Y'all are moving too fast. What the hell, Mike? <laughs> I know he didn't just take the fuck off without me. Oh my god. I'm gonna cry. He blasted the fuck out of there. Okay, mister. Uh, all of that is bullshit. Okay. Is it? How are you feeling right about now? Are you scared? There's some freaky shit going on down there, Harp. The weird part is that you ditched me. <laughs> you mean how weird you left me? <laughs> what the hell, Harp? I figured you would move your ass too. Would have been nice if you checked. 
Have you ever heard of fight or flight? Sydney, I'm sorry, okay? Whatever. Food's done, I'm ready to eat! Yes! Come to mama. Not me getting excited like I'm actually gonna eat in real life. Had to grab a plate. Who needs plates? Let's do it. Oh, guys, we're gonna get our little, like, ASMR again. This actually looks kind of bussin'. Let's do it. We're gonna get to chew. We had to catch that show on TV while we ate. Which show? What do you, what do you mean? Then turn it on? Hello? Why do I have to do everything here? Where's the remote? Look at him sit. Oh my god. Down the rivers. <gasps> oh! A mayonnaise water park. So first, we are going to prepare the asparagus. What? Season these with a lot. Oh, hell yeah, baby. Salt. Cooking show. Salt Let's good run it. The bones. Salt After is good. Simmer in the salt bath. We can start making the chocolate. And take a couple cocoa I swear beans. to God, I got my eye on that door. Uh, yes, the cocoa beans need to be blended into the sauce with a little bit of vinegar. Gotta keep uh, that fancy yes, the flavor cocoa beans. in there. The next thing we prepare is the mayonnaise. We stir fry this <laughs> in a pan with Irish tofu. Hello? Oh, this is gonna taste like shit. But here you are, anyway, listening to my cooking instructions. <laughs> oh my god! Bro is so goddamn honest. To make sure it doesn't revolt against us, it gets what? very angry once it knows we're trying to cook it. After doing that, oh yeah, that was actually really good. Ingredients together in a tray. We make a good team. You don't need to say that. I need to check my emails really quick. Left my laptop upstairs. I thought we were taking a break from work. It's not work. I'm waiting on shipment details for my new DS. His new DS! I'll be right back. Alright, I'll do the dishes. I fucking guess. a lot of patience and skill. What you will need is... I'm loving the TV on in the background. Gasoline and ramen? What the... Like what the fuck? Let's shut this. The gasoline into this pot. Make sure not to use whole gasoline since it's Let's, really oh, bad. Oh, so shut you. this. Yeah, don't use whole gasoline for the rest of the team. Two percent. Two percent. Half and half. Do not use diesel. <laughs> so after Do not that, use um, diesel. Dishwashing in it. I swear to God, if someone comes out the window. I'm not built for this. I don't know why. Who decided I was a horror game streamer? Like, some games, I'm like, yeah, that's fine. I got this. Like, whatever. It's the creep stuff, guys. I can't. I actually can't. Bill Nye Who. What are we listening to, guys? I think there's someone under my bed right now. Can you come upstairs? Michael J. Carter, you have to be shitting my pants. With the fire extinguisher. I hope it's Nora. Uh, uh, that would actually be so funny if it were Nora. I'm not eating this. But Karma's a bitch, and it's probably the mom that's haunting the house that bro ran away from. What bedroom is he in? That's a supply closet. Is he trying to scare me? I hope someone gets his ass. Like, I don't, I, like, fuck this. For, fuck him for making me do this. Okay, I just gotta go in the room and check. He's not in there. I'm leaving. 
Where you at? Pookie? Where my hug at? Where my hug at? <laughs> you know what? What if I just sprint in here? I might just do it. Fuck you, 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 I'm gonna murder this guy. I'm gonna kill him. It's me. Th this this is the plot twist of the century. I am the villain in the horror game. Junpei! I'm going to kill this motherfucker because he's just pissing me the fuck off. Like I'm I'm. What the hell, Mike? I totally got you. You actually didn't get me at all. I wasn't even scared. So, that's kind of stupid that you thought that. It's kind of embarrassing that you thought you actually scared me. It's kind of crazy. It's not cool. It was not fun. It was just a joke. Next round. I'll get you back for this. Whatever you say, Sydney Harper. Why does he use my name like that? What the fuck? Oh my god. I don't know what scared me more, the guy running at or your scream. I feel like my scream at that point was like, hopefully my scream scares him back just a little bit, right? Why did he go full name? I don't know. Legendary newbie, thank you babe for the prime sub. Thank you, love. Why did he whip out the full government name? <laughs> That was weird. He must have had Jet that screamed like a little weenie. Yeah, he ran upstairs. And now he thinks that's funny. You're on. I'll count to 10. We are not playing hide and seek right now. I decided to hide in the basement. I, me as my full grown ass woman self, I'm gonna play hide and seek with this man. There's no fucking way. Cause I'm gonna go to hide downstairs. And then I'm gonna like be down there for a while. You know what? I want that flashlight. Do you think he's counting guys? Where's that flashlight at? <laughs> Bitch. Oh fuck yes, you stupid idiot. You thought I was going to be scared down here. I decided to hide in the nook under the staircase. Oh yeah, that's not fucking terrifying at all. We added 67 bits and 33 bonus bits to rate to 92's <gasps> cheer. Thank you, Twitch. Oh. God damn it. You know what? I should throw this at him. I figured it would be good at this since I never find you in the city. That's amazing. You are so clever for that. Right, Sue, when I catch you! Oh my god, thank you for 666 bits. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Maybe you need to look harder. All right, my turn to hide now. You better be, you better close your eyes and start counting. Close eyes. One, Mississippi, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Watch him go in this room. Okay, nah. There's no way he's in the basement, right? See, this shit pissed me off because 
I didn't get to jump scare him. But he has all the fucking opportunities to jump scare me. I counted so fast, he could not have gone all the way upstairs, right? Did we lay did we lay some ground rules? I can at least blind him. I feel like he's in this room. Supply closet, bitch. I love that I left the TV and I was gonna turn it off, but then they started talking about like diesel and stuff and I was like, you know what, true. Do you think he's behind the shower curtain? That's classic, right? Classic son of a bitch. Nope, okay. I don't wanna go upstairs. That's not something I wanna do at all. Shit, he's upstairs. Come out, come out wherever you are, stupid Michael. Stupid, stupid boy. It's probably under the bed or some crazy shit like that. Oh, he's out here. He, he loves the outdoors. Oh, he's not. He's like, this view is incredibly slay. Girl boss or whatever. I don't want to check the bedrooms. I might throw up. He's probably going to be in his room again, like the basic bitch that he is. Basic looking ass. He's going to be in... I am avoiding the bedroom so hard. I already just got jump scared once in this room, so it's like it can't happen again, right? Got you. Oh, I got him. Hang on, Harp. I think I heard something upstairs. You're going to try this again? I really heard something sliding up there. You didn't hear it? What the fuck are you talking about? See this attic access door in here? I couldn't re reach it without the step stool. Why do you keep shutting me in there? The fuck? You're taller than me. Why don't you go? I think uh, my shoulders are too broad to fit through there, Sydney. But one of us really should look. Where are you? <laughs> Where are you hiding these broad shoulders, Mike? Where are they? Hmm? Seriously, Sydney, I don't think I would fit through. Use that step stool behind you and climb up. God damn it. Why does he... What in the delusional, like, body dysmorphia? He doesn't think his shoulders would fit through that? That's like a whole doorway, bro. That's crazy. Oh. That's definitely, uh... A picture. This... <gasps> Fucking fuck. Oh, my God. It's just a cat. Oh my god, hi! Hi! Oh my god, you're so cute. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, you're so cute. Hi, baby. Hi, kitty. You're such a good kitty. You're so cute. You're so cute. Oh my god, I love you. I love Are you causing all the drama? Are you what everyone else hears? You're such a good kitty. What's your name? I love cats. I love cats. I take home. Come here, Pookie. Oh my gosh. Animals are so much better than people. Where are you going, Pookie? Oh, there's a light. Oh my god, Kitty is so cute. <laughs> Ritsu, thank you for the power up for them. Kitty, will you keep me safe? What's going on up here? Should we do some more exploring? What's your name, buddy? Cat's name, guys. Chat, what's the cat's name? Am I ever gonna regret asking you that? Are you guys gonna give me good answers or something else? Meow. Meow. 
fucking cute. I don't want to leave the cat up here. Soup. Oh my god, I love that. Okay. Am I just gonna leave soup up there? It was just a cat. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you are the only pussy in the house. <laughs> the silence is so loud. Oh shit. What do you mean by that? It was just a cat. Oh, that's a relief. I was worried there for a minute. I think she was hungry. Maybe we can give her one of the carp after I come find you again. I don't want to play fucking hide and seek again. I want to pet the cat. I decided to head in the tool shed in the backyard. That's crazy. Why don't I just hide in the attic? Bro was so scared to go up there. That's what the plan should have been. And then I wouldn't be alone. I will be with a cute ass cat. Imagine I just sit there and start watching TV because I don't give a fuck about this game. Oops, we left the tool shed open. But at least the lights are on. Should I turn the lights off? Nah, he's probably gonna find us anyways. I wish I could booby trap this scarab somehow. <laughs> this is gonna be so boring. I just wait here. This is why hide and seek fucking sucks. It's so boring. You're either terrified and they're like really close, or you're in a good spot and they don't know where you are and you just sit there the whole time. I literally remember not liking hide and seek even as a kid. Unless you're really little and you're playing with someone who like knows where you are obviously. And then it's just playful. It's not actual hide and seek. Just go on Insta, you right? I can hear someone walk. <gasps> Why did the sound do that? I could hear him walking around, but I'm I thought, I was like, what if it's walking around and then I get a text from him and he's like, I can't find you anywhere, where are you? Or like, oh, I'm chatting with Nora in the house, where are you at? And he tried to like scare me again. Took me a while to figure out you left the house. Anything worth doing is doing, worth doing well. Wait, what? My turn, close those pretty eyes now. I'm getting tired. Ugh. All right, bro, I'll hide you. I'm not gonna do that though until we're inside and I feel safe. Mike was hiding. Was he? God damn it. God damn it. Thank you, Ben. Appreciate you, boo. Let's see, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, Mississippi. He's gonna be naked under the sheets. I would cry. I'm just gonna sit and watch TV while he's hiding. And he's gonna be like, I hid so well. He's gonna text me and be like, did you find me? Is someone knocking? He had to have gone downstairs this downstairs this time, right? Maybe not. I guess there aren't. What he? Oh, was he hiding somewhere new? I think. Somewhere new? Do we think the classic shower curtain deal? Nope. Maybe the supply closet over here? Oh, it's open. I guess not. Let, can we shut our doors? Thank you. Thank you. I cannot believe that they played hide and seek. Like, that. that's your, like, biggest red flag right there. Don't play hide and seek. It's the worst. See in here? <gasps> Pookie! He's gotta be out here, right? He's like, I'd stay in the house, you liar. Oh, he did actually stay in the house. Pookie. Oh, he's gotta be in the bathroom because I closed it. Oh, 
Oh my god. Why did I scream like that? That was the most relaxed I've been in the game. Why does she scream like that? Rick, why are you back? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? You should have told us, bro. This is my house. I don't need to check in with you every time I fix something. You definitely should. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I've never seen anyone fix a faucet with a hammer before. You ever fix many faucets yourself, young man? This is a horrible host. Just wait until I get my reviews in. Is that actually illegal? Right? Like, you're not supposed to be in the place that you rented out. Should have been in the contract. Didn't think so, so I'd imagine you don't know what tools you need. Is this late for you? No trouble for me at all, miss. I'm right around the block. I told you I'll get the sink fixed for you real soon. You need to go to bed now. You asking me to leave? Yes. No, Rick. She's being polite. We rented this house and would like to have it to ourselves. We don't really want to have to call law enforcement. That's crazy. You know what? I'll stand by him. Ain't no cops in Woodbury, son. We literally saw a cop drive by. You think they're gonna arrest the homeowner for fixing the faucet? I was just doing some work. If you can't handle that, that's your problem, not mine. You know what? If you folks don't let me fixing the faucet, I'll leave you to it. It's like, no offense, like, or at least text us and ask. Give us a heads up. Like, guys. I wanna, oh, he was looking for a cat. Should I tell him where his cat is? These people are all weird, thank you. I am not the only one. Everyone in this game is freaking me out. Everyone! Dude, this is crazy. I've been playing this game for two hours and our friend hasn't even showed up yet. After locking the door, we, we debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. If you peek through the window when you were hiding in the shed, you see him in the house while Mike is looking for you. Oh, shoot, really? Oh, I'm actually so glad I didn't peek. I'm so glad I just waited, did my time, waited in the corner, because that would have freaked me out. We, I, we attributed his behavior to extreme lack of social awareness. Weird, but probably harmless. Famous, famous last words for real. Look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves. But by this time, I was feeling really tired. Yeah, can we just sleep? I decided to get some rest. Thank you. Please don't tell me I'm being woken up. Bitch, who is knocking on my door? I still have my flashlight. Fuck yes. Oh my god, why was he? My heart literally just dropped. Why was he just a dark shadow? You still awake? Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. Do you mind if I come in? I'd like to talk about something. Oh no. Oh no. Hello? The storm is starting to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. I hate that Nora's out there all alone. She'll be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry, I'm here to keep you safe. What? It's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch pe over people they care about, right? 
I miss soup too. Where's the cat? Shut up, bro. What? I want my cat. He's just yabbing. About what? What a day, huh? This wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. It's been a strange day. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. Well, he does own the place, but I wish he would just cut it out. I thought you may be scared in here by yourself. Ew, I don't like where this is going. If he turns his head 180, I'll die. Yeah, me too. I'm, I'll leave. We'll run out. I'll take his car. Oh, no. No! This just became a true horror game. No! He wants to talk. Why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? I'd rather not. Like... In the dark, too, is crazy. If he leans in, I'm punching him in the face. Harp, you know- Oh, ugh. Guys, I can't do this. You know? I've missed this. Ew. Ew! Us. Just talking. It's been too long. I'm <laughs> stab my eyes out. I'd rather have the creep. I'd rather have the homeowner just show up fixing the bathroom and shit. You know. You don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. Mike, where is this coming from? Would you be doing this if Nora was here? Where the fuck did he go? Oh. Hello? You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon. I remember it being pretty awkward. <laughs> it didn't start out awkward though. Mike, we had a lot to drink, things happened. Oh, I think we hooked up. They sure did, I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. Jesus Christ! Mike, I don't know what to say. Oh shit, what did she say? SOS please. Just let me worry about the details, Sydney. I don't think this is a good time. Yeah. Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury, and my stinking Guys, tire just really. blew out. Oh, it's shit. It's snowing, and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. There's a sign by the side of the road. It's hard to see. I, I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half of a deep and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me? Oh boy. We gotta get our ass. Thank God. Any excuse is better than whatever this was. What timing, huh? I guess we can't leave her stranded. No, we can't. Better get ready. You stay here and get some sleep. There's no sense in us both freezing our asses off. Are you? I don't want to be here by myself. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. You're in pajamas and still dressed. You just settle in and I'll help Nora. I always like doing ugh, whatever. Please be careful. I don't want to be in this house by myself. Where's my cat? We'll finish talking about this later, okay? Get some good rest and stay warm. If you really feel like we have to. I feel like maybe we don't need to talk about it later. Oh, I couldn't have gone to bed without locking the front door. Bitch, did he teleport down there? Damn. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Why don't you get some rest while I'm home? Oh, while well, I'm gone. You sure it's safe to drive in this weather? Don't worry, I've driven worse. You're probably right. Make sure you take care of yourself, all right? Lock all the doors. You sound like my dad. Can you blame me? How about a hug? I mean, just in case you're asleep when I get back. Not now, Mike. Sweet dreams. Get some sleep, Sydney. 
fucking weirdo. Oh my god. Oh my god, that scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> okay, do I actually have to lock these doors or just like... I was keen on getting some sleep. Okay. Ah, uh, I wish we could like actually... Like, I could affirm that they were locked. And so they just close. Stop. He's such a where my whole guy guy. I can't. I told myself things would get better if I could just get some rest. Nora always knew how to cheer me up, and I needed it more by the minute. With her arriving soon, I decided to rest in the meantime. I can't do this alone. I swear to God, if something happens. Oh shit, are they here? They here? Someone was at the front door. It doesn't look like the... Hello? I can't see who it is. Guys! See, if this were real life, I literally would just ignore it. I would literally just ignore it, but I don't think I can do that in here. Well, now they know you're here. Hey, I'm using game logic. I feel like they don't know I have my flashlight. Oh, it's the pizza guy and you ordered one for me. Okay, we're good. I'll answer the door then. Hello? I saw you there, my friend. Ah! Is it the hiker guy? The hitchhiker? Please open the door. I'm freezing to death out here. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> nah, that's crazy. Then die. Then die. Why is it getting louder? I'm hiding, bro. Fuck this. He's gotta go away eventually, right? I can't do this. Yeah, why did it say it was four? I guess I went to bed at, like, midnight. Okay, so there's that spot to hide. I'm gonna throw up. And there was another one, was there not? Supply closet? Oh, there was somewhere in the basement. What, bitch? <laughs> Do you have any idea what time it is? I'm just not gonna say anything. Look, friend, I know it ain't ideal banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was counting on a ride from some friends, but they're running behind and they won't be here for about two or more hours. The weather outside is getting pretty bad and I was hoping you'd be a friend and let me come inside and warm up just until my friends get here. I'm sorry, but I can't help you. Come on now, my friend. If you were caught out in this blizzard, I'd give you a warm place to wait it out. You're- <gasps> Stop, stop. Okay. The, the fact that he keeps saying my friend is just freaking me out, and it always has. It always has. 
Tofu, thank you for 666 bits. I appreciate you. We added 67 bits to chaos underscore Tofu's cheer. We are not, we're not homies. We're not, we're not friends here. You're not coming in, end of story. Are you fucking kidding me? You're gonna make me freeze, let me freeze to death out here? Knock on someone else's door. Maybe someone else will let you in. I didn't make you hiking in a snowstorm. I should have known you'd be as big a bitch here as you were back at the pizza joint. It's crazy that I, I knew who it was because how he was talking. How does he know that that's me? Unless he followed here. You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek earlier? I figured maybe this time, wait, I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but it looks like you're still unkind. Get out or I'll call the cops. Ain't no cops around here. Why does everyone say that? Speaking of, I don't see your fellows check out here either. I'm dialing 911. Fine. Suit yourself. Nah, he was there the whole fucking time. That's crazy. <gasps> but let me tell you something. The, that's crazy. The man at the door seemed irrelevant to how tired I was. She still slept after that. That's crazy. Someone breaking into the house is... It's not even letting... What? At this point, I had no chance, but choice was to call for help. What? He's gonna be like, oh no. It's Rick. Despite how strange oh, Rick had been, oh, seeing oh, him oh. was a relief. Thank God. Oh my God, Nikki. <laughs> Stop, I'm literally panicking so badly. This is horrible. <laughs> Nikki, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, y'all, welcome. Open the door, miss, it's me. Okay, it's Rick. Rick, okay, okay, but break down. Break down for anyone who's new. Thank you, Ben, for the shout out for Nikki. Um, oh yes, please eat, please eat. Play this, okay, I don't wanna spoil it for you then. Go, go eat, do all your stream recoup. Love you, thank you so much for the raid. Appreciate you. For anyone who is new from the raid, um, 
We are in this house. It's supposed to be our chill vacation with one of our guy friends who's being so creepy and like hitting on us. And I was like, what the heck? And then our girlfriend met up late, like is got stuck on the road in the winter. And he's Michael, our guy friend is going out to help Nora, who is our friend. So I'm at this house alone. This is the owner of the house and he's being creepy and weird and he just will like show up in the house and he's like what you don't want me fixing the toilet and he's jump scared me so badly before anyways we literally told him to get the fuck out because we were like we're here come back another time but there was another guy who asked to hitchhike at the pizza place we were at when we were on our way and i told him no and he was like you you seem unkind unkind things are gonna happen to you he totally threatened us i was like what the fuck okay he came back to the house he's like i know it's you let me in i'm freezing and i didn't let him in and he got really mad and then i texted rick and i said hey creepy man come back here because there's an even creepier man so it's like two evils but what are you gonna do anyway this flashlight is not helping at all thank god you're here did you see anyone else outside I might have seen something. Could have been anyone or no one at all. Why is he gonna say it like that? Wait, should I be scared of him? Did I let the wrong ass dude in here? Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. Was the yelling? Pause, guys. I think the yelling was the hitchhiker. I don't know if they were in coots, but I feel like the hitchhiker was outside, but the owner of the house was stalking all around again, and he attacked the guy who was the hitchhiker guy. I bet you that's what that sound was. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. Like, are you kidding me? Rick with the hammer. Are his footprints bloody? Dude, wait, but this is not good because... He has his hammer! I'm gonna be murdered. I'm gonna be murdered. He should be back soon. Hmm. So you're all alone here right now, huh? I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I called the bad guy. I Fuck! Fuck! Abort? Like, what do we do? What do we do? What What do we do? What can I do here? My friends will be back soon. He might be trying to murder me right now. Should I just run up in my room and hide? Storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them know when to stay away. Huh? <gasps> We just got a text from the real Rick. That's not him. <laughs> I gotta cry. Fuck me. <laughs> I can't go up the stairs. Okay, so I actually want to be cremated for the record. <gasps> ah, stop, please! I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. The cat won't save me. They won't let me, it won't let me go upstairs. <laughs> He's probably gone. We added 100 bits to chaos underscore Xfu's cheer. Are you fucking my penis right now? I just want to go upstairs. I'm literally so cooked. 
I'm done. The music is horrible. Stab him like we said. Guys, I'm trying. It's not a crouch thing. I think it's going to make me interact with him. He has a hammer. What am I supposed to do? Every... Ah! Is there talk no jutsu? No, I literally can't. I don't want to talk to him. Maybe there's an explanation. Everything okay, miss? Yeah. It's awful late for texting, isn't it? Who are you talking to? It's my friends. They're almost here. Is that so? Yeah, thanks for coming by, though. You can head back if you want. I'll be fine now. You sure about that? Yeah, I just overreacted. Maybe I should stick around, make sure everything's really okay. Should I ask him who he is? I just like, I want to play nice. Should I ask him? Should I ask, should I ask him? You're not Rick, are you? Who said it's a rap stop? What did you just say? Confront! Confront! I'm an alpha! This is my fucking house. I will leave when I want to. What do you want? I want what's mine. This house and you. <gasps> we're toast! We're toast! Oh my god! Oh, we're fucking- we're- oh, we're cooked. We're so done. Oh my god. Oh my god. You're trespassing. Get out of here before I call the cops. Every time I say that, they say there are no cops around here. I don't think so. If anyone is leaving this house, it will be one of us. Interesting. Well, fuck me. Damn, damn, I figured that would be the best time to leave. When do they want us to leave the house? Oh, shit. I, I, I don't think it's as simple as that, because I'm like, what am I going to do outside? I think I have to hide from him until they get back. I think I have to play fucking hide and seek. Shit me. Where's my flashlight? No, where's my flashlight? Where my flashlight at? Oh my god, thank fucking god. Cause his shoulders won't fit. You know what I'm gonna do? That's my plan. That's my plan. The hide and seek was a tutorial. That's crazy. What if I didn't open the door? I'm not really paying attention to the prompts. <sighs> Fuck, okay. So he started like hammering that door shut. Uh, 
Oh yeah, it won't let me go any farther than that. What if I did this? Oh no, because it's going to make me talk to him again. Uh, why wouldn't I text my friends and be like, hurry back right away, please, Pookie? Okay, sh this is fine. Yep, it's like instant death if I if I try to leave. That is so violent. Okay, good lord. Good lord. But okay, sorry, we're attempting that again. I I did want to double check. There's no way you can just walk out. It's kind of annoying that you have to replay it though. But whatever. Um, he doesn't have the right tool for a lobotomy. You know what? That shit is just so mad crunchy. Okay, so what do we think? If I run upstairs, though, I have to run right by him right here. I feel like I should go in the basement and hide, no? He knows this house, though. I feel like I have to go to the attic. Cause, right? Cause even if he looked, he like wouldn't think that I was up there, I feel like. I don't know, I'm gonna barf, whatever. Oh, also, wait, Mac, I have a huge favor. Can you private the live stream from YouTube? I don't know if it's set to automatically private or not. Soup, soup will save us. Oh God. Okay. Wait a minute, did he tell us where the power? Hold on. Rick was in the house, yes, I'm aware. Did he tell us where the power stuff was? Oh no, he was just talking about the flashlight, right? <laughs> Rick was in the house. This is actually fucking insane. I hate this. Yeah, I'm toasted. Excuse me, sir. Who are you? Confront. Get out before I call the cops, you silly billy. Why am I? I really feel like there's nothing I can do. I Am I just screwed if I piss him off? The only other thing would be trying to go down to the basement and then hiding. Or the attic. No, I literally couldn't go upstairs. Oh, you can't let the convo get that far. Well, there's literally nothing else to say. It, it just has me keep asking the questions. Yeah, I gotta play it cool and then casually sprint in here and go in the attic. That's still my plan. I still want to be in the attic, guys. Can I just not let him in? What if I didn't? I 
I probably have to, right? I don't know how to de-escalate this situation. I did try to leave after I got the text. It wouldn't let me. It said I didn't, it says I didn't feel safe leaving when I tried to do that. He should be back soon. The fuck, bro? And then it doesn't let me log out the back either. I'm really, it's really hard to tell. Like, I, I just might be screwing up the dialogue. Like, part of me really just wants to, like, hide. Why don't I just go in the attic? and just wait there. But I don't think that's how the game is gonna let me proceed. Cause anytime I'm not downstairs, I just get prompts that Rick was in the house. Hi kitty. You'll protect me, right? I think it's really important that I get the reveal that that's not Rick. Shinriki, thank you so much for the stretch redemption. So I don't think I can run away from the situation until I get that text. I can't really interact with a lot of things. Yeah, maybe we find a weapon. We've had to do that in these. Yeah, it does bar me from going upstairs. Oh. Okay. Good for you. Uh, let me summon help. <laughs> I wonder if, as I get that text, I can <gasps> shit me in the fuck. I dropped my flashlight. Guys, I dropped my fucking flashlight. Where is it? Why aren't any of the fucking lights on? Guys, I am not doing this without my flashlight. Ah! Oh, I think I see it. I think I see it. Oh my god. Holy shit. Imagine. Yeah, so as soon as I get the text, it doesn't let me go upstairs. And it doesn't let me go outside. Oh, fuck. Wait. Oh, yeah, it doesn't let me walk past here. Why is he eyeing me like that? I can go downstairs, though. I cannot go out the front door or up the stairs. I actually might be able to go downstairs. I don't know. I haven't tried it. I haven't tried. Oh, my God. I can go down. I can go down.
He hasn't started chasing us yet because we haven't talked to him. Hide when he nails the door. I need to open that fucking door. I think I have to interact with him more. Ugh. I just, if he, ch I don't want him to chase me when, he, when I go down the stairs. I might have, yeah, he might chase me when I go down the stairs. You can head back if you want. Yeah, I just overreacted. You need to leave right now. Yeah, I have to confront him no matter what. I don't think so. If anyone is leaving this house, Oh. I'm gonna lose my mind. <gasps> Fuck! I feel like part of me was like, maybe I shouldn't have tried to run out of the room. I didn't know where he was, I wasn't looking. But the, huh? Totally meant that he knew, like, he was gonna open it, right? Oh, hiding in the basement, what? What do we? Yeah, maybe. front of me I don't have my flashlight oh my god I can't see shit in these games guys are there settings out here <laughs> toilet sounds oh my god you can turn off eating sounds that's crazy <laughs> I'm gonna cry oh my god so basically <gasps> mm. 
Why am I getting stuck here, bitch? I, I literally, I know there's a chair there. First of all. I get it, I'm done. I know there's a chair there. I literally went to hug the wall and it just had me be stuck on the window. Bitch, I guess I can get up, close the door and go on the other side. That's just like a little annoying though. I think I'm gonna try to close the door and just like go around the other side. He broke the handle, I'm an idiot. <laughs> you know what, bitch? I can just hide in the closet. I don't have to go to the attic. What the fuck am I doing? I don't have to go all the way to the attic. I can just hide in that closet. Fuck. Why did I do that? I was like, I have to grab the step stool. I have to play some step stool. No, I don't have time for. I could try the back door. Oh, you're actually so right. Bitch, let me try the back door. But it's also hard because it's like, I'm gonna run out. Here's, here's what I'm thinking. Like balcony, there's not really a way down. Back door, I run out into the dead of winter and then what? Hopefully my friends roll up. Whereas if I hide again, Hopefully he's dumb and he can't find me. And then my friends will show up to the house. Like, I feel like I would need them to show up to the house to save my ass. Or should we say, no, don't rely on someone else. Wait, I'm a bot? Oh. oh! Oh, oh, look, there's a table! He pushed the table. That's what I was running into! Oh my god, that's what I was running into! He pushed all the tables and chairs and barricaded that door. I was like, why can't I go forward? Oh my god, that's why the furniture literally moved. I thought I was losing my mind. Holy shit, that makes so much more sense. Upstairs it is. God damn. This is why y'all vote on how many times I'll die, huh? <gasps> she probably called and said, we're outside waiting for you, Pookie. And I'm like, thanks, I'm actually dead. take too long this is there's like actually no way you can beat this game on the first try because you don't have any time for like a single error and now that it respawned me and I don't have a flashlight I can't see shit but at the same time it might honestly be on my monitor because sometimes I look back at gameplay and I can see it way better and it's just so much darker on my screen I don't know if shutting doors is going to be super helpful.
We added 67 bits to rate to 92's cheer. Get to them when they're here. That's crazy. Joey plus one, thank you for the tier one. Three months, baby. Like, I, I don't have time to bring the stool into that room. I barely can even make it into the room. It takes like so long for me to grab it. And then even when I'm in the attic, what do I call it, the window for them? I am so impressed I stayed quiet. Holy shit, thank you so much for the jump scare. That was so evil. When you hear the safe sound. Yeah, cause he's still in that room. I can like hear him breathing, right? Do I try shutting doors? <gasps> oh shit, I could have shut that door maybe. That's the right plan. Like, what the fuck is being in the attic gonna do? But I don't think I can get back out of that room. I, I swear to God, he's right there. I can get the ladder on time. I was there. We're fucked, we're fucked, we're fucked. He can't get up here, right? God damn it, guys. I swear to God, if this hoe calls me one more time. Me not having the flashlight is like not okay. Anything up here? Where's the cat at? Where my hug at? Oh, there's the cat. I literally think I'm stuck as fuck up here. I'm so worried she's gonna keep calling me. Like, <gasps> holy shit, do you guys see those shadows? Oh no, what was that? Can I text them? I don't think I can. Help. That's so stupid. I would literally text them in this situation. Where my hug at? 
I think even after I text them though, like I can't get them into the house when there are barricades everywhere. Flicker the lights? You know, that's actually not even a bad idea. I don't think it's gonna work, but like IRL, that's not a bad idea. See, I'm so afraid this hoe's gonna call me again and then toast me. Okay, so there are literally two doors. One of them is hammered in. I can't touch that one. Ooh, maybe I can go to the balcony? Hey. <laughs> Here's the thing. I don't think I wait because I was up there for a while. The sound was looping and they keep saying like there's no sheriff in this town. So like who the fuck is going to help? I really don't think waiting is the move. Well, like, I, I don't think he'll come up to the attic, but what the fuck am I doing up in the attic? Why does he hit you with that eh? every time? Stop. Guys, what the fuck? They just keep ringing the doorbell. Why wouldn't I text them? I'm gonna lose my mind. Okay, what did she probably, what did she do in the story? What do we think she did? There's no way to tech, to answer the text or answer the calls. It just taught me how to hang up. You think she waited? I waited for so long, I can't keep waiting. No, what do you mean they're almost there? They're at the house. They're knocking and ringing the doorbell at the house. They can't get in because all the doors are barred shut. So they couldn't do shit anyways. Why the fuck wouldn't I call them? I don't understand. Guys, I'm gonna get pissed. Wasn't the hallway closet hiding place? It wasn't a mic'd up hiding place, no. I think you can hide in there probably. But. Let it ring. Not gonna lie, kind of a bad time, kind of a bad time, kind of a bad time. Hey. Literally in my head, I was like, if I set this down, isn't gonna is it gonna make a loud noise? And I was like, I don't remember it ever making a loud noise before. Oh my god, I'm just getting impatient at this point. <laughs> I'm tired, guys. Wait for the doorbell. There's a sound cue, that exact one, the shoo is the one that will tell me I can set down my big ass ladder.
it's not, I can't actually answer it, and it's like the more it rings, I think he might actually find me. It's not letting me answer it. That's so stupid. I can't answer it. And now that I think he's called, I think, now that that call has happened, I think he's like right up my ass. So I'm not gonna be able to go under, down. Go under, down, girl, what? Go back down. Hello, friends! I am being murdered in here. <laughs> Please send help when you get this message. And add me back on Discord. Can I, <laughs> bro, I'll send a message on the cat. Can I like put a note on the cat? Also, where's my flashlight? Damn, I'm so sad. It's really annoying that it doesn't... You can't start off... at a part with the flashlight. Yeah, there's nothing up here I can interact with. I don't really know what the move... I don't... I'm not really sure what the move is. Okay, but maybe the whole, like... There are no police around here. You know who told me that? Fake Rick. Frick, if I dare. You can hear him breathing under there. That's crazy. Pookie. You can literally see that he's under there. I've called 911. Oh my god, I was impatient. I, guys, I was... I swear to God, I was up here for so long. They've called 911. I'm just gonna wait now. I'm not running. I literally set a timer. I promise you, I was up here longer the first time than I was just now. Or if I wasn't, it was by like, f not even four seconds. Oh, maybe I should read the text. Uh, there's someone we met here, he's banging up. Okay, I'm glad. Even though it wasn't the right Rick, I'm glad he's alarmed. Pookie. I'm just gonna wait here for the police. I'm gonna wait with my little cat on the ground. My cat is gonna keep me company. Can I crouch, please? Hi, ah, you're so good. You're a good little cat. Oh, soup. Legit, I think the trigger is looking at him through the attic door after the ring. That's crazy. I didn't know I'd be able to see through it like that. Why did the lights go out again? Did I turn them out? That's crazy. Right, guys, I don't go. I just have to wait for the police now, right? I've had to do hella waiting in Fears to Fathom games, which is why it's hard, because you don't know if you're doing something wrong or if you're literally supposed to just wait in a room for like 45 minutes. I'm not risking going without the police actually being here. They've called 911. 911 better fucking be on their way. And like the thing is, he left. But I don't know if he like fully left or not. And if I go downstairs and die, you guys are gonna be like, you're being impatient again. You're so impatient. You're gonna be such a little impatient person. I know I'm impatient. I don't know if he's gone though. Leave the attic. I'm scared. We gotta go. Do the it clown theme while you wait. Do it. You can't know if he's. Oh my god, you guys are bad influences.
Alec Martins has just donated $6.66 for a jump scare. Okay, the chill music is playing again, guys. I think it's over. I also can't sprint. I think it's over. I think he like fully left. How did he leave? Whoa! Oh, now you break down the door after I come downstairs and get you. Holy shit, guys, that's how you know in a game when the music changes. That's your only actual final cue. <sighs> I told them everything that happened after Mike had left. Rick had called the cops. The storm had quieted down by the time they had arrived, and of course the man was nowhere to be seen. They never found him? On our drive back, the whole night played over and over in my head. Well, that whole night played over and over for me too, but for other reasons. We think that the man we saw secretly lived in that cabin when it wasn't being used and planned on robbing us during our stay. But cops seemed to think that there was more intent behind this man's actions aside from just robbing us. Rick had asked me what the man looked like, and after that, he didn't ask any more questions. We think he knew more than he was letting on. I bet you that shit had happened before, but because he didn't want to, like, bring down, like, reviews or anything, he, like, didn't say anything about it, and he kept renting it out. But in the end, oh, thank God he gave us a full refund. That's crazy. And I bet you Mike is still gonna be like, where my hug at? I swear to God. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. Fears to Fathom once again succeeded in creeping me the fuck out. What I really, really don't like about these games is like the parts that seem realistic or especially the parts where like there isn't always something to do. Sometimes you're just literally supposed to wait and not do anything. And that drives me insane. And I'm not very patient. And then other times that I actually am patient and I wait, I'm supposed to be going down and doing something else. Girl, I can't win! But anyways, I had fun. Thank you for joining me for another Fierce of Fathom episode! Another one done. Checked. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already. If you haven't seen my other Fierce of Fathom gameplay, I have it all in a playlist, so be sure to check it out. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Bye, loves.